Welcome back viewers and now let's get the top breaking of this hour according to the sources ahead of the formation of the Maharashtra government after the recently held assembly elections it is clear that Devendra Fadnavis will be the Maharashtra chief minister due to massive mandate the BJP did not hurry to announce anyone as the CM face as it would have given a wrong message of hurting the Maratha sentiment. Shinde himself announced his decision which eased the pressure on the BJP and days after speculation on the name of the Chief Minister of Maharashtra after the BJP-led Mahayuti's win in fact was secured. Now the name for Devendra Fadnavis, the Deputy Chief Minister of Maharashtra, Pradesh, Maharashtra is in fact getting clearer where in fact it is expected that oath-taking ceremony will be followed soon. All right, now joining me live on the broadcast is my colleague Anand Singh, in fact, on this news break. Anand, very good morning to you. What it seems like coming at this point of time after days of speculation on who will be the Chief Minister of Maharashtra is uh, what was most expected. And now Devendra Fadnavis is, in fact, uh, likely to take the top uh, chief post while the other people of the cabinet will be now constituted between uh, the uh, uh, key portfolios. What is the latest that, in fact, you are tracking at this point of time? Are there any other probable names for or uh, the uh, number of portfolios that have been confirmed so far? Yes, Simran, look, uh, the day on which the election results came, it was very clear that the BJP was not going to leave the chief ministerial post with the numbers they got over here in Maharashtra. As the BJP was just sort of majority on its own by only 13 seats, as it got 132 out of 288 seats. So the BJP, uh, before deciding on the chief ministerial phase, uh, it uh, waited for Eknath Sinde to give a message that he was not in the CM race uh, as because the BJP didn't want to give a wrong message to the people of Maharashtra as there were two Maratha faces over here in uh, uh, the top leadership that included Eknath Sinde himself who had broke the uh, Siv Sena earlier and he had joined the hands with uh, BJP over here and formed the Mahayuti and similar was the case with Ajit Pawar who is also a Maratha face. So the BJP didn't want to hurt the sentiments of Maratha that uh, they used Maratha uh, people over here to just uh, come to power. However, they waited for Eknath Sinde to announce his decision. And then it became very much easier for the BJP to have its own chief ministerial face. And what we have learned from our sources that the name of the Devendra Fadnavis is almost confirmed. The, uh, almost 95% chances are there of Devendra Fadnavis to lead the state once again because if uh, we talk about whatever the, the reasons uh, earlier when many people have cited that BJP has been uh, giving surprise faces in similar, several of the states like in Chhattisgarh or in uh, Haryana or in Rajasthan or in Madhya Pradesh. So, uh, looking at the scenario here in Maharashtra, Devendra Fadnavis has uh, led the state as chief minister for five years but it was not the condition uh, with uh, either Sivra Singh Chauhan or Vasundra Rajay or Raman Singh, as they had uh, uh, led the state uh, for more than 10 12 years. And if we talk about Sivra Singh Chauhan, especially, he was the chief minister for around 18 years and he had uh, he is also 68 years plus. So, looking at the age and factors behind Devendra Fadnavis, uh, he is young, he comes from Brahman community, he was the face of the party over here in Maharashtra elections. And then the way in which he had led the BJP over here in three consecutive assembly elections, this cannot be ignored. This is what the BJP leaders uh, are also accepting uh, behind the doors that the way in which Padnavis who was the a state BJP chief between 2013 to 2015, the BJP got more than 100 seats. Then also in 2019 assembly elections, BJP got uh, 105 seats. And now in 2024, the third consecutive assembly elections, which the BJP fought, especially on the face of Devendra Fadnavis in Maharashtra, especially where uh, even the posters of Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Amit Shah, all the top leaders were there, but it was Devendra Fadnavis who was taking all the attacks of the Mahavika Sagadi and opposition leaders on himself, and he led the BJP from the front. So, looking at the contribution, the way in which Devendra Fadnavis had worked in last 15 years in Maharashtra, 
it is almost certain that uh, Devendra Fadnavis is going to be once again the chief ministerial face of Maharashtra. And if we talk about portfolio similar that you just mentioned, uh, we have been indicated All right, by Anand, the... In fact, so, so, I'll request you to kindly stay on with me on the broadcast while we also get my guest uh, Chandra Mishra as uh, in fact 